Okay, YouTube, we're back out at uh, range and uh, gonna be shooting the uh, 7.6239. This is my SKS and a ATA ATI stock, uh, collapsing and foldable. Uh, the stock is pretty heavy. I like the other one I had, but uh, I might change back. Uh, last time I was at the range, I couldn't get the uh, NC Star scope uh, zeroed in, so today I've uh, taken and put a very large piece of paper behind the target, and hopefully I'll find out what the heck is going on with this thing. And uh, if you recall, this is the one I uh, shortened the barrel on and then put a different type of uh, flash suppressor on there so that's what's going on with that so we'll take this one out and then uh, we'll look at the uh, Bushnell on the uh, Zestava M77PS uh, okay uh, what you're looking at is my SKS target and it looks like I was able to uh, get that sighted in pretty good yeah I was all over the place I started out here over here on the bottom, came over here, uh, over to the right, and then over to the left, uh, dropped a couple, but that was me, not the rifle, and then uh, finally in the middle, I was able to hit. Now we're going to 308 on the Sestava M77PS, and I couple, snuck a couple rounds out here on this one, so uh, coming up, and uh, then I'll put a new target now, and we'll see how that goes. Okay, so uh, it's getting late at the range, and I was uh, running out of time, so I was hitting this target with the 308, and you can see the 308 rounds here. Uh, I think those are mine. So uh, I was shooting at a different target than was over that, but it blew down in the wind. There it is, so uh, no joy here. It's, I'm really running out of time, so uh, also I hit this target uh, with the... Uh, with the SKS, uh, with the ATI stock, this is, uh, I had 100 yards, so I'm hitting here, I'm hitting all over the place. I was a little right and a little, uh, a little high, so uh, I'll probably adjust for 100 yards on that.